Hey guys, my name is Frank Dorf and I'm gonna demonstrate you a small tip with two of the Rogue Flashbender products. Now, the first product I'm using is the XL Flashbender. The second one is the Strip Light with Grit. And I added a little bit of extra spice in that one by using a red gel. Now, one of the things that I love about the small flash system, and especially with the Rogue Flashbender stuff, is that you can actually gel a complete softbox in seconds. You just use the red gel or any color you want, you put it on your strobe and then you mount your modifier and the whole light will be red. So that's what I love about these products. Now this little package contains the color gels. They actually have two sets. You have the color correction gels, let's say if you're shooting with tungsten light or fluorescence. So you can use different colors to correct the colors, but these are the more special effect ones. Now, if you open it up, you can see that there are different gels, like red, green, blue, and a little elastic band. And this one is really important. You put this one on your strobe, like you're gonna see in the video, and then you connect the gel to your strobe. The fun part about the small flash system is because you're using the gels on your strobe, you actually are gelling the whole softbox. I wish they had something like this for the big strobes in the studio. But for the small strobes, this is a vital piece of care. Now the setup is very, very simple. I want a high contrast image. So what I actually did is I created this one very close to the wall and I bend the light like I showed in a previous video. I bend the light to get a lot of structure from the wall, but not a lot of light hitting the wall. This is perfect for people who have a small studio or if you have to do it in your living room. Because this way you don't need a lot of space and you can get a high impact image. And of course you can still walk around your model and create stuff from every angle you want. And remember, every time you walk around your model, the contrast changes, the light quality changes. So you have unlimited options. When you gel your strobes, you have two totally different light sources. And you can combine the two, make them blend together. And it's very easy to do.